How to use Judgme for your Shopify store. Full guide. Hey guys, welcome back. Now, if you're looking to add product reviews, then Judgme is an amazing application that will enable you to add product reviews and also filter and edit reviews. So let's get into the step-by-step -step process of how you can integrate this product reviewing application of Judge Me into your Shopify store. So let's get into it. Now, the first thing you have to do is head on over to your Shopify dashboard. Once you are in your Shopify dashboard, you want to click on settings on the bottom left. Once you click on settings over here, you want to click on apps and sales channels. Once you click on apps and sales channels, simply click on Shopify app store on the top right. Once you click on Shopify App Store, your Shopify App Store will open up in the new tab. And from here, you can just search for Judge Me. Now, Judge Me has three different types of applications, as you guys can see over here. You have Judge Me Product Reviews, Judge Me AliExpress Reviews, as well as Judge Me Checkout Comments. Now, the one that I'm going to be focusing on is Judge Me Product Reviews. This is the one which enables you to add a widget for product reviews into your products and also to be able to edit and modify reviews. The AliExpress Reviews application is primarily to import reviews from AliExpress onto your store, especially if you are doing something along the lines of dropshipping, then you might want to import reviews. And then the checkout comments are when someone makes a purchase and after their purchase, they can directly review how their buying process went. But we're going to click on Judge Me Product Reviews and then click on Install over here. Now we're going to complete the installation and once you complete the installation, you can get started with the setup. So just click on install app over here and within a couple of seconds, your installation will be completed. So you guys can see Judge Me has now been installed. Now you will see the Judge Me icon will pop up on the left side of your screen. I like to click on pin to navigation just to make it easier for us to access. Now it's only a three step installation. From here, you're going to choose the language that you want. I want English and then your current theme. So this is our current theme, the default theme. Then you're going to click on add app. Now you can skip this, but I recommend just setting up judge me over here because it's only three steps. The first thing you have to do is enable your app embed. So click on enable app embed and in a new tab, your Shopify website editor will open and you will automatically enable the judge me reviews app. You will see the app will be added and then you can click on save on the top right. Now, once you've done that, you can click on next step and then you have the review widget. Simply click on install review widget and the review widget will be added. So currently our review widget is being added. And if I scroll down, you can see our review widget has been added. Now, if you want to delete any section, you can just click on this trash icon on the left and a section will be deleted. Now, this is our current review widget. If we want to move this up, simply click on the dots on the right side of the screen on the right side of the particular item and then move them up or down wherever you want to place them. So after you've completed this, simply click on save on the top right. Now, after that, click on next step on judge me and then click on install review badge. Now, once you do that, the review badge will be added to your products. So as you guys can see over here, this is the review badge. Now, these are these number of stars that have been added. So if I want to delete them, I can click on this and click on delete. And you guys can see this is the badge that has been added. I can move this around within my product information as well. So I can move it directly below the product name or I can move it below the price like this. So just like that, I can place it wherever I want within the product information. Now, once you've completed this, click on save on the top right, and then your judge me product reviews have been added. So once you do that, simply click on finish and your basic installation of this has been completed. So now these widgets are going to be available on all of your products. Just to show you guys, let's go into products. And then if I take a look at this product over here, you guys can see currently it does not have any reviews, but you guys can see the customer review section is present. Now, how can you collect reviews and how can you manage those reviews once you start getting them? Because sometimes you can get unfair reviews or really negative reviews, which might not be reflective of your business or the quality of your product. Well, there's a really easy and simple way that you can solve this. To do that, simply click on judge me reviews on the bottom left. From here, you will have a drop down menu. You have a few different types of settings. First off, you have manage reviews. So in this section, you're going to be able to see all of the reviews for your product. You can see that I've hidden this review, which is a review that I found to be unjust. 
Now, you can also do this for really positive reviews or you can heart them or pin them to the top. You will be able to see all of your product reviews over here. Now, if you want to filter out the type of reviews you're seeing, so you only want to see reviews for one particular product, you can go into product reviews and you will be able to see the particular product and you can filter out the product that you want. You can also see store reviews, spam and archived reviews as well. Now, after that, you have the collect review section. Over here, you can send out email requests to your particular customers after a certain amount of time that they've bought the product that for them to be able to review the product. Usually, it's just an email where you're like, hey, you bought this item. Please tell us how did you like it? That is the basic kind of email that you can send with these kinds of integrations. So to do that, you can click on scheduled requests on the top right. Click on scheduled requests for previous orders. Let's say for people that have started creating orders from today, I want to send two emails like this, send requests. Now, just like that, a request would be sent to, the, to those customers. Now, you can click on emails as well and click on manage email templates to be able to actually customize the content of your email so it better fits your brand. Now, after that, you also have SMS and push notifications, so you can collect reviews via SMS and push notifications, as well as moderation. So publish new reviews automatically, or if you want to publish reviews manually. So after that, you can filter out the reviews once you get them, and then you can only show the ones that you want. You can also do review restrictions, so only buyers who have received a review request with email or and API users can request can actually you know post reviews. Only buyers who have review received an email request or no restriction. So if you put no restriction, anyone, even if they have not bought the product, could actually review the product. Then you have personal information. Censor personal information and publish reviews or hide review containing personal information. And then you have some profanity filters as well. After that, you have the judge me review widgets. So the default widget is not the only one that you're stuck with. You actually have multiple different styles that you can choose from. You can choose the one that best fits your actual business or business niche or business style. Now, depending on what kind of niche you're in, the standard one might be okay. If you're looking for something more modernized, you can go with the star rating badge. You also have the floating reviews tab, all reviews page, reviews carousel as well. Now, after that, you have your marketing and social. So if you go into the marketing and social tab, you can start building referrals, coupons, social push, and more. And then after that, we have one of the most important settings of the judge me reviews tab, which is the general setting. Now in your general settings, the first thing you have is language and your basic installation. However, after that on the top, you have these panels and in your panels, you have the plan. Now currently on the free version of the judge me reviews tab, you can get free unlimited reviews. However, you don't have the judge me branding removed. So if you want to get the judge me branding removed, you can upgrade to the awesome plan starting at $15 per month. After that, you have the branding. So in your branding, you can choose the primary color that you want to use for your tabs or for your buttons or for the review widget. So you can choose any color that you want and click on save on the top right. Then below the color, you can also enter the URL of the image or the logo of your business. And then that will be integrated into the review widget as well. And then you have integrations, notifications, and some advanced settings, which can help you in optimizing your review widget for your business. So I hope you guys found this video helpful. If you did, make sure to leave a like and subscribe.